morning everybody and uh, hi, it's a beautiful day we are going into a heat wave here in the Netherlands so take care of yourself of the sun's rays and take care of your pets and for anybody that is in a heat, heat wave take care of your pets and everybody around you and yourself and your skin don't let your dog or children stay in the car okay well, well that's just a piece of advice for me today and this is your reading for the 23rd of June 2020 and we've got the six of swords and magic from the mystical uh, shaman deck and this is the six of swords from the enchanted dream tarot and I'm going to hold them up for a second so that you can see the artistry because I think these are one of my two favorite decks and we know what magic means it has the number 33 so that is a six again so you've got two sixes so the angels are with us and sixes also balance now I'm going to do again um, I've had a nice um, reactions of the uh, working with the chakras and so I'm just going to teach you a little bit about the book that's what the book looks like and the uh, review is out there on um, YouTube not yet on the website Facebook and Instagram we have the green triangle which means air then we have the touch symbol and that is an other therapy and that means it is fixed and then we have the planet we've got a planet here today as you can see that is the planet and that is Mars so we have a masculine um, uh, planet here because Mars also uh, uh, represents the man but also war and arguments it is the planet of arguments and war then we have the zodiac sign in this case Aquarius and Aquarius is of course also air and then we have the chakra sign the shape of the leaves of the lotus now we all know that the six of swords in tarot means moving on moving away from difficulties moving away from old emotions moving away from something and going into a new phase a new period gentleness quietness and we are in the energy of um, cancer it also means in tarot that you might be moving home but not only home but if you are uh, a person that has their own business you might be expanding or moving to smaller uh, premises to bigger or to smaller whatever is uh, positive for you moving away from the negative into the positive it also means we might be going on holiday or immigrating as we cross water you might be crossing water but it doesn't have to mean that you're immigrating it could also mean that you're moving from one state or one uh, parish to another province or an other state or to an other side of something like a bridge a bridge crosses water a lot of the time so you might be crossing a bridge to get to the other side okay just remember that you might be on a bridge today and crossing that so that's crossing from A to B I I always thought from right it's moving away from something or moving home or going on holiday but the more I work with the tarot I see more things you might be moving away of being shallow spiritually and you're going deeper within 
once you start working with the cards you get deeper and get more insights and that's why I thought I want to do something different because I'm a Reiki master not practicing uh, professionally at the moment but I am a Reiki master we all know so now I'm going to go back to the book and give you the highlight of what the author in this book says the quality very focused but calm the planet mercury communication reason skill intelligence verbal expression so mercury is also a planet besides mars but mercury is um, an, uh, a mutual sign which is also let me have a look mercury um, reason skill intelligence verbal expression that is mercury so it might be a very communicative uh, day to day like I said you might want to go deeper into knowledge into yourself or in something else you might be doing research in order because of Mars the planet Mars that is with this reading or with this card the six of swords drive desire and courage but Mars is also war so that you do not have to go into uh, war or arguments today because you've been forewarned but you also forewarned that you might need more information or to do more research with regards to a situation or an issue now the attributes of the six of air is safe serene and focused it is about moving away from danger towards a better place six of air is inarticulate inarticulate yet understand understanding the six of air influences accepts help from others it looks forward to what is ahead and is optimistic about the future advice appreciate that difficulties are behind you you no longer need to be self-conscious or hold on to prevailing negative thoughts you are out of danger but because we have the planet Mars here you are you have to be aware that there could be difficulties so move away from other people's drama stay away and you will be safe but always be conscious of arguments story the story every sign or every card has a story the story is at times in my life when I did not know that step to take next what step to take next I asked the universe and in my case also the angels and my guides to show me the unmistakable sign when my siblings and I moved my mother out of the condo in Florida I went to clean up her apartment all her friends and our relatives were advising me to find renters I wasn't so sure I just couldn't picture how that could be managed and none of us had affinity in Florida it wasn't until I got there that I realized how much work it was going to be the potential tenant I would I would have been referred to wasn't calling me back and I was hesitant because I heard she smoked cigarettes Oh gosh that's discriminating well never mind in between packing up all my mother's personal belongings I kept asking for a clear sign at one point I went into the room facing the outer walkway where the window was open someone was smoking on the upstairs walkway the smell of the burning tobacco was pouring into the room I immediately closed the window a few hours later I went back and could still smell the smoke 
This was my sign not to rent, because we could never sell a place that smelt like cigarettes in humid Florida. I immediately consulted my siblings and we agreed to sell the apartment. Everything from then on went smoothly. Although we sold it for far less than my mother bought it for, those particular apartments continued to go down in value. So we did far better than we would have had we waited. Well, that is a sign from the Divine or the Universe, and that is her good right, but I still think don't discriminate whether a person smokes or not. A paintbrush and, and a new carpet and cl cleaning stuff will help you there. So that is how you can solve or move away from smoke. That's just an example. And also, you should never judge a book by its cover. Why did a person smoke? Some people have cancer or are in pain and they smoke. So never ever judge. That is also a message. Move away from judging a person. Now we go, we um, have the heart chakra and the heart chakra, okay. We have had the the heart chakra that means I love it. the heart chakra is also air so it also means think think research for more information well I've already said that you might need more information communication okay so talk to people why do you smoke that is what you could have asked you could have approached a person and ask why do you smoke Okay. Um, the organs from the for the uh, um, green triangle, the air cards, um, air is of course um, um, not only the heart. I'll read you a bit. I've got to just find it because this book is full of. Um, information and the last couple of days I used uh, the heart chakra but I'm going to go into something else now um, let's have a look you can use the short um, notes and that's what I'm looking for and that will help you so you don't always have to go back to um, the chapters. Right, so here we go. The six of air characteristics. Moving away from danger towards something more peaceful. Very focused and calm. Quality. Controlling. Mer the planet. Mercury. Okay, mutual. But we also have the planet Pluto. Oh, sorry, Mars. So that also means war. And then reversed, we have miscommunication. That's the six of air. Miscommunication. M musings is acceptance, objectivity, and reason. And you need communication to reason or to do research. So that is the short story. Now the air chakra is all about compassion, desire and self-acceptance. That's the heart. It is the chakra that is midway between the seven chakras and helps us to separate as well as integrate. To separate the bad from the good, to get clarity. <coughs> In Sanskrit, for the air chakra, is anahata which means unstuck the color related to the air chakra is green the symbol is a six-pointed star it is correlated with venus the planet of love and the sound vocalization is yam 
the gland associated with the air chakra is the thymus, which aids an immune system functioning. The planet Venus corresponds to the air heart chakra, bringing love and compassion. Okay, there is more to the heart chakra, like um, as the organ, de uh, that's the heart, as the organ develops, it sends electrochemical messages to the brain. As the heart develops, it begins to regulate the chemistry throughout the rest of the body. The heart is the center. This is what I'm saying. The heart is the center of the being. I think of the heart as the kitchen, the heart of the home. That's where the magic happens. The communication, getting wisdom from your mother or your father. The nurturing. The heart sends signals to the brain that triggers coherent feelings. This triggers a sense of peace, connectedness, trust and well-being. And that's what you also get in the kitchen. Okay. Now, it's getting quite long and I don't want to um, take it too long but the longer I go get into this book the more I get fixated now if you would like to know which chakra you would could do for the air chakra meditation focus on the breathing because air is also lungs Gemini is the lungs okay clear your mind and open your heart and take it from me to open your solar plex. Following the breath is one of the simplest ways of meditation. So do the meditation that we I do on the live sessions and have a look. Okay. And um, I don't know all the uh, uh, organs uh, related to the star signs yet, but um, I know Gemini uh, usually is the throat chakra, Archangel Michael, and here the Archangels aren't really, um, uh, are not the same as what I know. So I can't, uh, I do take the author's signs of the uh, Archangels, but I can't find them now. So excuse me, but um, the have a look. The air signs. Uh, Gemini is shoulders, Libra is kidney, and Aquarius is ankles. And the gemstone for today is emerald. So wear an emerald um, color to enhance healing or relaxation and detoxification. And I know that it's also the lungs okay i hope you have enjoyed so far the magic uh, book that is the sharma magic i've already explained what i think the magic is that is like the magician a new beginning you've got all the talents and all the gifts to make it happen new beginnings you are moving away so it's explaining more or less the same this symbol represents the infinite intelligence of great spirit that makes up for fundamental fabric of the universe and you are a fundamental fabric of the universe you are an individual we experience the evidence of this magic through synchronicity or meaningful coincidences the invitation of the task at hand when magic appears you are invited to see the world through the eyes of the wonder and awe taking on the innocent innocence of the child who knows that all things are possible infinite potential exists in the great mind like the swords Gemini so that's the um, swords and you are being invited to call it, it in and recognize the dance in synchronicity. If events, signs, symbols and omens give you to you through the oracle of ordinary world, 
this is the sign that spirit is reminding you that you co-create your world in a sacred partnership like I said you've got all the talents you can make it happen your part is to dream to intend in other words manifest or visualize and ask and to watch for the signs that show you what next action to take right now it happens that you are on the right track to make your dreams come true great spirit is listening and acting on your behalf pay attention magic gives births of miracles so your wish or your goal be might be coming true to you today like I said and moving away perhaps towards your goal as we have the six of swords before it I love it I hope you do too take care and be blessed and please share and like and if you would like to use the book um, a tarot with the chakras and have a look at the review it's on YouTube and I will be putting it out onto the website today charliesangeltarot.com all the information you can find below the video or click on the white dot in the right hand corner of your screen and you'll be taken to the website love you and enjoy your day take care